My name's Aaron Ralston. My parents are Donna and Larry Ralston of Englewood, Colorado. Whoever finds this, please make an attempt to get it to them. Be sure of it. I would appreciate it. 305 on Sunday. This marks my 24 hour mark of being stuck. In 2003, Aaron Ralston was hiking alone in Utah when a rock fell and bound his right arm. Stuck there for five days without food or water. He finally made the difficult decision to escape. Ralston's amazing story was later adapted into the movie, 127 Hours. Aaron Ralston was born on October 27, 1975 in Ohio, USA, to a middle-class American family. His family moved to Colorado when Aaron was 12, and he developed a passion for outdoor activities such as hiking, climbing, and skiing. He attended Carnegie Mellon University in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, where he earned a degree in mechanical engineering. After college, Ralston worked as an engineer in Dallas, Texas, and later in Arizona. He wanted to become a professional mountaineer and never had the courage to quit his job. But in 2002, he had a decisive change and resigned immediately to pursue a career in mountaineering. Colorado was famous for mountaineering and is known for the 14s, a mountain range of 59 peaks. On April 26th, Aaron decides to go on an adventure on his own and not tell anyone. While hiking alone in Plujan Canyon in Utah, <sighs> He became trapped by a boulder that impaled his right arm. He felt like he would still be stuck there. He tried very hard to reach out his hand, but in vain there was no point in crying out for help, and he did not want to exhaust himself so as not to waste so much energy, necessary to survive an ordeal that could last for a long moment. He kept trying to get his hand out, but it got stuck between the rock. After two days, he realized that it was impossible for him to free himself from the rock and that there was no point in shouting. After five days of unsuccessful attempts to free himself, he decided to amputate his arm with a pocket knife. As part of this preparation, he carved his name, date of birth, and estimated date of death into the stone. He fell asleep that night, convinced that he would not wake up the next morning. However, he was miraculously awakened by the strange idea that he would be able to tear his arm away from the rest of his body and free himself. Determined and using his very limited tools, he succeeded in having his arm amputated, bleeding profusely, leave the valley as soon as possible. Fortunately, a family who was on vacation saw him and gave him food and water, then took him to the hospital. Doctors gave him emergency treatment because he had lost about 25% of his blood. The accident made Aaron a celebrity, and he started appearing on numerous talk shows. He is immediately hailed as a hero. In July 2003, he appeared on The Late Night Show with popular Letterman presenter David Letterman. Ralston wrote his autobiography, Between the Stone and the Hard Place, which instantly became a national bestseller. This story served to inspire British director Danny Boyle into a film starring James Franco. It was released in 2010 and was a hit, and... After the fame, Aaron Ralston became a celebrity and made the best use of this fame to inspire more people around the world. His decision to continue mountaineering with a prosthetic arm was met with worldwide recognition. In 2005, he became the first person in the world to conquer the famous 14 mountain range in Colorado.
Aaron Ralston. I came out of my grave and came back into my life. 